Running up towards the finish, and it's Alwyn Brook as they go towards the finish. It is Alwyn Brook and Andrew Lynch who beat Don't Fudge Me Closer. The presentation taking place after our second race, the was Common Race Course.ie made in Division 1. Have you had further success on the track previous to this? Uh, not really, this is the first one now in home race. Uh, this is really the first one, hopefully, this afternoon. <laughs> Well, your campaign further over hurdles now, or will you go chasing? Uh, I think we'll give another shot over hurdles. We haven't decided yet, maybe down the line we'll be. There's, there's chasing in the families, definitely, but we'll stick to hurdles for the moment. Delighted at the minute. Delighted. They race up towards the final 150 yards. It's Manny Corris, the leader from the left row, as they go to the line. Benny Corris will win it for Danny and Max Mullins, Benny Corris. Very nice win there, Benny Corris, uh, back to back. Nice win in Killarney for her. Yeah, she's a good mare now. She had a couple of good runs um, over her uh, in Leopardstown and Avon, so she's a proper winter horse. Uh, we give her a break, and like a lot of mares, they seem to improve with the sun on their back, so. Um, we're hoping to go to Galway now. There's a, there's a Mayor's Handicap Earl in Galway on the plate day. You're a, a great contributor to National Hunt Racing. You've bought many, many horses, and of course, everybody agonised with uh, the tragic loss of our Connor at Cheltenham. Uh, hard for you to get over that one. Ah, oh, yeah, it's taken a while, obviously, yeah. But, uh, you know, we've had a, a few nice winners there. We won the, the Mayo National Ballon Road there last week as well, so the season has started off well. And uh, still as enthusiastic as ever. Ah yeah, sure it's a brilliant game, you know, it's, uh, if you have a couple of nice horses, it's, it's lovely to come racing on an evening like this. Interior Breeze written by Ian McCarthy, running out a convincing winner there of the Ivan Connaughton Auctioneer Handicap Hurdle. One won nicely. Yeah, it's done well, um, I'm very happy with him. He just wasn't right after then, Patrick, and he's run him right now. You haven't gotten too long? No, well, we have him probably from December time, and it took us a long time just to get him right, you know. And then we thought we had him right, and we had him right, but we have him right now, so. So, will you continue handicap hurdling with him, or give him another go and then chase? Yeah, I'll give him an argo over the handicaps and hurdles, and then we'll go chasing with him. He's a big, scoopy horse. He's run over fences around down the royal, so if he's run, jumps around there, he should jump around anyway. I'm delighted to be a sponsor uh, once again this year, uh, Connaughton Auctioneers, and uh, I want to congratulate Neil McKnight and his horse and Imperial Breeds for winning the race that I sponsored, and I wish him all the success into the future, and indeed the racing here in Roscommon. Once again, a uh, successful year started, and I want to congratulate the committee and the great work that they're doing for the local economy here in Roscommon Town. Over the last, Ellie Lee in front, as they begin the run now, up towards the finish, Ellie Mee and Andrew Lynch out four in front, chased down by Andrew Hunt. And making the presentation, Mary Regan is joined by Sonny Shane and Eamon, who are presenting to the winning trainer, Jim Draper. Uh, Shane Regan is my name, from Regan's Bar and Restaurant, uh, Quinton's Restaurant in the square in Roscommon Town. I'd like to thank Roscommon Racecourse. All the committee are excellent. They have done serious work for Roscommon Town. Regan's Bar and Restaurant, is open all the time, uh, good food, good music, and we're here all the time. Take your cap off the leader, racing up to the finish, take your cap off the pole car race, going on, on Gunnery, give me a break, and turn it late to head four. Joe very generously sponsors the best turned out in each race. So thanks to him for that uh, generous sponsorship. It's on the last 150 yards now, and it's nothing Arrigan as they race up towards the finish, and nothing Arrigan will complete the hat trick and wins for Mark Enright. Polish partisan second, third home boss Kroger. 
Nottingham Eric and completing a nice hat trick of wins for Neverleaguer, Desi Hughes and Mark Enright. So our congratulations to them and well done. Up towards the finish, New Kid in Town is staying on the stronger, and New Kid in Town will win for Patrick Mullins.